Good morning. It's going to be another day dominated by sunny spells and sharp and thundery downpours for many of us. So if you have seen some early morning sunshine, I hope you managed to get out and enjoy it a little. It does become quite messy as we go through the day. We've had a line of more heavy persistent rain from these weather fronts that are slipping their way south and east over into France. The heaviest of the rain across southwest England and south Wales over the last few hours. And as it pushes its way down through the Channel Isles, we'll see a fair amount of cloud and some shower outbreaks of rain almost anywhere across Channel Coast. At the same time, we'll see a line of more heavy thundery downpours developing across Wales up through the Midlands into eastern England through the afternoon. Some of these really quite torrential and quite widespread. For Northern Ireland and Scotland, it's not quite as severe. Sunny spells and a few isolated showers as we go through the day. Top temperatures of 9 to 12 degrees across Scotland and Northern Ireland. Highest values of maybe 10 to 13 across England and Wales. Now we'll see a spell of heavy rain moving its way through eastern England overnight. Clearer skies out to the west, so a real contrast with the feel of the weather first thing on Saturday. Saturday morning, low single figures, frost not out of the question in sheltered rural parts, but where that rain is, well, that's where we're likely to see the temperatures holding up. So on the whole, it's an improving picture as we go through the weekend. Finally, we're going to lose the frequent showers and we're going to import a southerly flow. So mild air will start to push in and temperatures slightly above where they should be for the time of year. So early rain will clear away through eastern England. Cloudy skies for a time, but the sunshine, the best of it, out to the west. It'll be a pleasant afternoon for many of us. Largely fine and dry. Any showers will become fairly isolated. And top temperatures likely between 10 and 16 degrees. That's 61 Fahrenheit. As we move into Sunday, that dry weather story set to continue. We could see a little more in the way of cloud, particularly up into the far northwest and thick enough maybe for a spot or two of drizzle but on the whole dry settled pleasantly warm and certainly better than it has been over the last few days and that trend is set to continue through the week ahead an easterly wind might just prevent those temperatures from climbing too high but nevertheless settled and pleasant